Major wildfire continues to burn in Walker County today. More than 24 hours after the flames first ignited, the Game Preserve fire started yesterday afternoon off of FM 247 and FM 2989. That's just southeast of Madisonville. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Bill Barajas. The fire has prompted a massive multi-agency response from fire crews. KPRC 2's Corley Peel is live in Walker County now where a command center has been set up. Corley? <coughs> Bill, this is an all hands on deck situation right now, and we just got an update from officials. And right now, that fire has spread to 3,800 acres and is 20% contained. Now, on our way up here, we saw some signage on 45 North alerting people to use alternate routes and to be aware of smoke and fire danger. I spoke with Texas A&M Forest Service, and they say there is a possibility that it could be closed if it was a safety issue. But right now, 45 is open. Now, this fire did start around 2.30 yesterday afternoon, so it's been burning for more than 24 hours now. A voluntary evacuation order is in place. Official has announced yesterday or today that anyone living in the Cedar Ridge subdivision is recommended to evacuate. Homes on Lost Indian Camp Road have also been threatened. And the Good Shepherd Mission of Martin Luther King Boulevard is a place where people can go if they've evacuated and they need a place to stay and to seek shelter. Shelter. So as of right now, no homes or structures have been damaged and no one has had any injuries, according to officials. And right now, the cause of this fire is still under investigation, but officials tell us this could take days to put out. We'll continue to keep you updated as soon as we know more. Reporting live from Walker County, Corley Peel, KPRC 2 News.